Hi guys, good morning, good afternoon, good day. Good morning. You have Marta and Sandy. Hello. We are ready to do a weightlifting exercise class to work that body. You can do it standing, but for the most part, we're gonna be sitting in a chair. I just wanna say hey to Monica and Ron, faithful folks watching our uh, exercises. All right. All right. So we're going to warm up, and we're going to first get a chair. We're going to sit down. It helps if your chair doesn't have arms. We're going to ask you to go get cans of soup, water bottle, whatever. You might even want to freeze your water bottles or gloves, right? It'll be easier to lift. So we want to think about your center strengthening your body, your muscle, your core, strengthens us to go forth with greater awareness and ba balance. We've gotta have all that. So we're gonna put our feet in front of our knees. We're gonna lift up in the center. The navel goes towards the back. Bringing those rib cage and navel together. It's called a contraction. You're gonna exhale, <sighs> suck it in. But you keep your back from the crown of your head down to your tailbone, straight, lift it up out of your hips. Anything else, Sandy? That no, sounds good. Fabulous. Yeah. All right, so even when you march, we're gonna start marching using the major muscles to warm up our body, to warm up that engine, the core. And it's easier when you use big muscles, right? Four, three, two, now as you march, don't let your feet come back here behind you. How can you have any control of your core, right? Lift up, feet out front. Be aware of your feet, your toes, your fingers, everything. Lift up, and let's do a little flex, Sandy. We're gonna flex the feet, stretch it out. One, two, three, four, three, Two, and tell me you're not sitting back in that chair, right? Yeah, we don't do that. You sit at the edge of your chair, you lift up. We do not take little kitty naps or relax or slouch during workout time. You got the rest of your day to do that. That's right. Knees up, Sandy, we're going up. Keeping that core lifted, four, three, two, we're going to do double, 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 one more, kick it out, one, two, so we're even using the arms right now, the shoulders are engaged, we're kicking, we're warming up all those body parts that we're going to be using to lift weights, we need those weights, don't we, Sandy? Yes, we do. Why do we need those weights, Sandy? Tell us. Keep our muscles stronger. We just got to keep moving. It helps us to get up and down, in and out of cars. We got to work those muscles. It helps with the connective tissues, ligaments, all of that. Work together. And weight training will do that. Okay, so all now right. we're going back down. Tap. One, two, three, four, three. Two, one, hands on your thighs, feet parallel, knees hip width apart. You're gonna do a nice flat back, hold, reach, change, reach, support in the back. Nice and easy stretch in the obliques, all the way around the back. Good, one more, coming up. Pick up light weights. Now you can do this without weights. So we're gonna start with light weights. We're gonna switch to heavy. And then there may be a time where we can go heavier. When you change that weight load, it helps that muscle to keep reacting, rebuilding. And it's what we need to keep our bones healthy, circulation, the whole thing. So pick up those light weights. Got it. Okay, I'm gonna be working a little bit on the upper body. 
Sandy's going to do the lower body. So we're gonna start with the traps. Exhale, lift up one, two, three. Now lift your toes with it. Toes up, four, three, two, one. Now circle back, one, two, circle front for three. Now that was just really beautiful, a lot of fun. Put those light weights down, go to a heavier weight load. All right, so we're gonna lift the traps. One, two, those are the muscles behind the neck, we need to get them. Give me three more. Two, roll those shoulders back, nice and easy. Roll them front, guys. Now we're gonna go into the obliques. You're gonna exhale and just contract that right side even as your left is stretching. Exhale up to the other side. So it's kind of contraction stretch. Isn't that fun? Yes, it is. We're gonna do one more. That's good. All right, that was lovely. Go back to light weights. Going to it, Sandy. All right, we're gonna lift the toes, side lateral lift, middle down, toys engaged here. One, exhale, two, keep the elbows soft, three, you're lifting with that middle deltoid. Give me two more. Keep that core lifted. Now we're gonna go front lateral. One, two, three, four. I want three more. This is three, two, one. Let's release, go to heavy weights. Here we go. All right, guys, we're gonna lift those toes, side lateral lift. Exhale, one, two, three, four, three, two. All right, take it to the obliques, exhale. Lift to your left, nice and easy. Back to the right, last time to the left. We're gonna go front lateral lift. Toes are gonna to go right with you. One, two, three, four, four more, three more, two. Warming up. I, I know it, last one. We're gonna put those weights right on your knees. Flat back and lift up. So now I wanna incorporate the back just a little bit with your rectus abdominis. Take those lovely heavy weights, hold them. Elbow to the knee, lift it up. Oh, and that fun! And elbow to the knee. Nice and easy. Exhale, keep your back flat. Last time, let's release. Now we're going back to light weights. Back to the shoulders. Core lifted. Bring the weights up by your shoulders. If you can't go above your head, you can go straight front, and Sandy's gonna do that. We're gonna alternate, right arm up, left arm up. This is full range, elbow down to the side, go on up, rotating towards the front. Oh, this is good. So this time, they're both gonna go up, we're gonna do eight. You're gonna alternate your knees up with them. Exhale, one. Knee lift, two, three, four, four, three, two, one. Alternate now, elbows or shoulder level. One, two, three, four more, four, Three, two, and one. Both going up, knees are coming up with them. One, two, 
three, exhale, four more, four, three, two, one, bring them down slow, excellent, traps up, one, two, three, now, roll it back, one, two, three, front for me, one, two, pull to your right for four, four, three, two, we're going left, nice and easy, four, three, two, now we're going to bring those elbows in, if you can't go up, you're going to go back, elbows to the knees, exhale, push up, one, down, two, lift, exhale, back stays flat, Core stays really lifted. Right to the backbone is that core. We're going to do two more. One more. Halfway up, guys. Little press. One, two, three, four, three, two. Release. We're going to switch up to heavy weights. Heavier weight, right? Everyone does a little bit different heavier. Okay, we're going to back to the traps. Exhale, lift one, two, three, four down. Weights are up, heavy weights. Alternate, take the knees with you. One, two, three. Four more, four, three, two, one. Both are going up, both weights, not both knees. That'd be a good trick. Yeah, that would be. Four, four, three, two, one. Now halfway down, tiny press. Two, three, four, four, three, to bring it all the way down to the right side, easy. One, two, contraction stretch. Three, we're going to the left, to the left. One, two, two more. Last one. All right, here's your challenge. Elbows coming to the knees, flat back, and lift. Bring it down. Two. Lift, three, lift, four, three more, two, last one, bring it down, good, march it out, we have four, three, two, one, release, light weights. Going to biceps. Where are they? Right here. They're right there. The front of the arm. We're going to hammer curl. Elbows close to your body. Lift your toes. Here we go. One, two, three, four. Excellent. Four more. Three more. Two, one. Elbows up. Right knee up. You're going to kick. Give me a little shoulder presses. One, two, three, four, three, two. Change. Left knees up. Kick it out. One, two, three, four, three, two. One, coming down, hammer curl, knees up, one, two, three, four more, four, three, two, one, rotate, palms out, bicep curl, extend that right foot, flex the right toe, we're going to exhale and lift that right leg, one, Two, three, four, 
three, beautiful. Four, it's a nice straight leg. Using those major muscle groups. Those quads are working. Two more. One more. Now we're gonna change. Hammer curl. Lift that left leg. One, two, three. You're doing good. Pulling abs in. Four. Yes, Woo. pulling up. Three more. Two more. Last one. Bring knees and feet together. Light weights in your hands. Elbows to the knees. Woo, lift up. Bring it down. Now bring those elbows down. Hammer curl. Down. Biceps up. Woohoo. Hammer curl. Biceps up. Hammer curl. Biceps up. One more set, guys. And then we're going to go to heavy weights. Yay! We love heavy weights. That we see. Yes, we do. We're going to hammer curl. Elbows close to the ribs, core lifted. Knees up, one, two, three, four more, four, three, two, one, we're going up. Now as we go up, we're gonna hop it out. Knees right over the ankles, bring it down, two, Three, four more, four, three, two, now hop out for me, hold it, bring it down, right elbow to the knee, incorporating those obliques, exhale lift. We're going to do two more, excellent, one more, change, down one, Two, we got two more to go. Three, this is it, four. Excellent, right elbow inside, concentration curl of the right thigh. Exhale, lift one, two, support the body, left hands on the left thigh. Four more, four, three, two, one, Change. Left elbow inside the left thigh and curl. Two, three, four, four, three, two, one. Excellent. Walk it in. You're going to do hammer curl, hop it out. One and down. One. Two, three, core tight, guys. And four, four more, three more, two, one. Woo! We're going to put those weights down. Breathe in. Exhale. You're going to breathe in. We're going to pick up the light weights. We're going to triceps. Where are they? Woo! Back in the arm. We all need it. Yes. In this fun. Now yes. pick up this light weights and run. Run like a hamster. Woo! Four. Three. Two. Stop. Feet parallel. Hands on your hips. Elbows close to the body. Lift the toes. Kick back. One. Two. Three. Four more, four, three, two, one. Alternate, one, left, two, beautiful. Three, four more, four, three, two, one. Both feet up, kick back, eight, seven, six, Five, four, three, two, weights are going to go down. Before we pick up one light weight, 
We're going to keep that core lifted. Arms are out to the side. Working on the core a little bit. Elbows to the knees, opposition. Here we go. One, two, three, four more. Exhale, four, three, two. Give me double right here. Double, 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 single. One, two, three, four, four, three, two. Elbows to the knees, pull down. Now lift the arms straight out. Pull down, suck in as you pull down. Exhale and lift. Give me one more. Good. Now one heavy weight. Still working triceps and we're going to legs. Right? Yes. You're taking that right arm up. You can't go up. You're going to do what Sandy does. Kick back. Yes, almost forgot. Almost. I'm so used to doing it now. Okay. Core tight. Lift a one, two, three, four more, four, three, Two, one, change. Left side, lift a one, two, three, four, four more, three more, two, one. Bring it down. Now I'm going to switch over. Our body's kind of warmed up because we have been moving, changing our weight loads. Sandy, come on up. Okay, let me get my uh, weights here real quick. A heavier pair. You got eights up here? I do. Okay, hello everybody. <coughs> hey Sandy. And what, Hi everybody. What, what we're going to do today, what I'm going to do, we're going to do some squats with weights. We're going to do some lunges. We're going to do some deadlifts just to stretch all those muscles out. The one thing that you need to do is remember how to do a squat and to always push those hips back like yes. you're sitting down. Is don't let your knees go forward. That's when you get in trouble. So just practice a couple where you're actually pushing those hips back. When you go back, yes. you should feel the glute muscles activate and bring you back up. You're using your glutes, your lower back, your thighs, right? Yes. Those of you that are used to using heavier weights, do that. But if you're not, I would stay with no weights and just do the exercise or do the water bottles or something like. I'm gonna start off with a medium weight for me. And uh, like I say, you have to choose what's good for you, right? right. What you, your body is used to doing. If you can't stand up, you can sit. Down. You keep working with us long enough to be able to stand up. Absolutely. But you can sit and work your legs at the same time she's standing, squatting. Right. So you can look at me. I don't like to have to sit down here when she's really working her body out. Let me tell you that I will behave myself, so. She is doing it for you guys. I'm doing it for you guys. We you guys can do this. Yeah. We want you all to benefit. First thing, we have weights in front of our hands, end to end. They're gonna stay there. It's just an extension of our arms. But when you do a squat, remember your chest is up, your shoulders are down, your back is contracted. So it doesn't move. When I'm going down into a squat, I don't let my shoulders go forward. And if you don't learn to bring those shoulders up, then it goes into your lower back. So we're gonna practice good form with squats. Again, everything tight, your core is tight. Take it down. Lift the leg if you're sitting. And then push up. We're not going real fast with this at first. But again, form is everything. When it comes to working out with legs, doing squats, lunges, you gotta have good form or you can't hurt yourself and we do not want that. We wanna build muscle around those knees. We wanna build muscle in those quadriceps, the front of your legs, the hamstrings in the back, lower back, so keep it nice strong a little arch in the lower back take it down i don't know how many that was we're going to do four more give me four give me three and i did this a little slower just to get the blood to all these areas now the next set we're going to do 
bring your feet in just a little bit closer. And what I'm doing is bringing my weights up. So my weights are actually sitting on my shoulders right now. And you can do that. You can keep them down. You can put them in front. So you have options here. But when you put your weights up here, this is how I learned to do squats. It forces you to keep that upper body up. It won't let you bend over. You can't because you got weights on top of your shoulders. This is three. Push it up. Four. Think about your glutes. You're pushing. Five. Contracting. The weight I can feel in my thighs. Give me three more. Give me two more. Give me one more. Now before we go to our next exercise, bring the feet about hip width apart and I'm gonna go into like a mini deadlift. So my knees are always soft. You don't lock out your knees, but your legs are straight. You take it down, feel the stretch, bring it back up. You take it down, feel the stretch all the way down the back, the legs through the lower back and the glute area. Take it down, Woo! bring it back up. Already I can feel my body heated. It's getting warm, right? That's a good thing. These are big muscles. One more. Bring it up. Woo! Let's oh, take it yeah. down. So we're incorporating upright rows, which gets into the back area. Take it down. Bring it up. So it's not so much a squat at this time. It's a little deadlift into an upright row. Give me two more. Give me one more. Woo! Bring it down. Now your feet coming together, and I hope we can see me do this. Because what I'm gonna do is a lunge. I'm gonna take my foot out to the right side. This leg is not going to move. And as I go down, I'm taking my weights down. And then I'm pushing off and bringing it back. Taking it out. You push off with that foot that's going out. Your knee is slightly bent, so it's not a straight leg. We are actually bending the knee on this side, but the supporting leg is straight. But we're pushing off and we got weight in our hands. So I'm feeling this work. Give me two more. Woo, I can feel up my glute muscles. Bring those feet back together and I'll move over so you can see the other side. Nice stretch out. Take it down, bring it up. Take it down, bring it up. Take it down. Marta is modifying the move for those that are seated. Again, don't use any weights. If you're not used to doing this, give me one more. One more. Very good. Now, my right foot is back. My left foot is forward. My heel is on the floor. My hand is on my left leg. So I'm gonna go into a row with the right side. I'm bringing it in. As you do this, feel your back. Feel that, woo! Inhale down, exhale up. So I'm getting, my breathing is in coordination with the muscle movement. Four, three, you're squeezing that back on the right side into that shoulder blade area. Give me two more. Give me one more. Other side, switch feet. Again, parallel position. That back heel is on the floor. I've got my hand forward. Bring it up and squeeze. It's not going past my hip, because this is back work. Give me four. Give me three. Give me two. Give me one. Now, bring both feet together as we do three different exercises in groups of eight for the back. I'm, hips are back. I'm right here. Bring it up for eight, seven. Again, put some oomph in it. Work that back. Well, Give me four. Blades together, guys. Give me three. Give me two. Give me one. Now, the palms are facing forward. Bring it up. Again, squeezing the shoulder blades together. Give me three. Give me four. Give me four more. Four, three, two. One, this time we're still in the same position. Palms are facing back. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Woo. Bring it up. Woo. Now, step 
bit stiff leg deadlift. My knees are soft, taking it down to about mid calf. Feel that stretch. Bring it up. Shoulders go back. Again, this is stretching. All the muscles we've been working. One more. Stretching them out. Blood is flowing. Woo! Now, what I would like to do is do a stationary lunge. And there again, feet are in parallel position. And you could put your right hand, right weight on your right side. Just hold on to it while we go down. Just up and down, working. Our thighs, you can sit on the edge of that shoulder. Stand, Marta. You can stand up and hold on to something. Yeah, that is this, good, too. Right? That is a good way to do it. The back knee comes down. You can Not always hold on to over the ankle. Right. You can hold on to a chair, a counter, whatever is sturdy that you can hold on to to keep your balance until you learn the form. Because my shoulders are down, my chest is high, and I'm going straight up and down. I'm not leaning forward, I'm not leaning back. And this is a good way to learn some balance. One more. Woo, I can start feeling this. Okay. Right foot is going back or just switch legs, however you're doing it. And this weight on this thigh is adding resistance. So that's a part of this. Take it down, bring it up, down, keep good form. So you're looking forward, your abs are in, not let that knee go out. You make sure you're back far enough or do as Marta is doing, holding on to a chair, and keeping your feet closer together. If you can't get a long stride, give me three more. Three, two, one, bring it up. Woo, I am feeling this today. I am too. How much longer do you want to go? Take it down. A little deadlift. Bring it back up. Take it back down. Bring it back up. Take it back down. One more. You want me to go on with another set? One more set. One more set. Now, this is... Uh, you can use heavier weight or light weight, however you want to do it. This time, we're going to go over, but we're going to bring it this weight up. It's over, weight up. So I'm just bringing it to my side, right here. Or over. You can just bring it up. Yeah. Give me three, two, one. Other side. So we're taking it down. We're bringing it up, down. You can keep the weights just hanging at your side or don't use weights. Get the movement. Once you're comfortable with the movement, you can always add weights. Give me two more. Give me one more. Woo, this Woo, is good. Sandy. All right, taking it down. Nice stretch, let your weights go. Putting your hands on your thighs. Feel that stretch. Always have soft knee. Take that right arm forward. Nice little reach there. Bring it down, other side. Woo! Now, as you come up, bring your hands together. Pulling down in the back. Feels good on that back. Pressing up. Make sure your shoulders are down. Chest high, lift that chin. Bring it forward, interlace those fingers. Pushing forward. Feel that nice stretch in that back. Take it up if you can or go forward. Take it out. Hey, this has been fun. We have, I enjoyed uh, my workout with you. Yeah, we're glad that, that we can do this. We want you all to stay well, stay safe. Yes. We're getting ready to bring on board Aaron. Woo! He's going to do uh, some extra goodies for us too to help keep you guys all moving. Yes. Please keep this in mind. We miss you. Eat well, stay well. And if you want to watch all of our fun videos, there's the info. Let's get it done. Yes. Thank you, guys.